I'm Olivia, I'm a quantity surveyor and I've been with the business for six and a half years. So the apprenticeship route really stood out to me because of the fact that you can gain the experience of your role whilst also learning as well. During my four year apprenticeship, I spent time between college and also getting the hands-on experience. So I worked in a variety of different departments, um, procurement, estimating, um, but I also gained on-site hands-on experience as well, um, which really helped me to gain the understanding of the technical um, side of what we do. So quantity surveying is all about, you know, looking at the um, financial management of a project, but you really do need to understand the technical side of it as well. Growing up, I was always exposed to construction. Um, my dad and my sister both work in the industry and typically going out at the weekend would always be driving somewhere and my dad would always say, that's my site. My sister would say, I've worked there. Um, and that was really interesting to me because you could actually see the final product of the project that you'd been involved in. So during the four years, I was able to spend time in different departments. So whilst you get experience in commercial, you also get experience in um, estimating, um, procurement and on-site experience. Um, and during that time, you're really able to draw on the experiences of the people that you're working with. Um, you get to <clears throat> build relationships with those people. And when you do go back to your own function and department, you can then build on those when you have to communicate with them on other matters. So one of the biggest challenges for me um, when I joined the business, I started at a young age. Um, and coming into the business, you work with a lot of experienced people who have worked on a variety of projects and some of them have been with the business for many years. And as an apprentice, it can be difficult to get your point across in the right way, but with the support of my line manager and also the apprentice development team, I was able to grow in confidence to be able to ask those questions. So on one of my previous projects, Brentford Community Stadium, because it was such a big team, we really had to um, improve our communication skills. So it was really important that I was speaking to different members of the team from the various departments so we were able to progress the works. Um, but also having the confidence to ask those questions of the relevant department leads is really important as well. So throughout your apprenticeship, you really get to build those relationships with the key people um, and then you're able to ask those questions. So since the completion of my apprenticeship, I've continued my educational journey. So I've just completed my degree in quantity surveying and I'm currently working towards my RICS accreditation. So my top tip for any apprentice starting with the business would be to embrace the experience. You really do get to work on a variety of different projects with lots of different people, all of which have been in the industry for a long time. Um, during my apprenticeship, I was able to work on some really prestigious schemes, including Brentford Community Stadium and the new development at the All England Lawn Tennis Club.